My name is Rebecca Stone Thornberry, and I am the director of the Diary of Anne Frank at UW Marinette. The story basically concerns um, Anne Frank, who is 13 when the play starts and 15 when it ends, and her family, Otto Frank and her mother, Edith Frank, who are forced into hiding because they're Jewish and the place set during World War II. Anne and her family, when they went into hiding, uh, they did not know that they would be there for two years. And they were in a very small space. They lived over Otto Frank's uh, business. He ran a spice company. And it was his employees who had agreed to help them hide from the Nazis. And many people were going into hiding. You've got a lot of possibilities for drama when you've got people in very tight quarters with one another who are of different ages, different backgrounds. I think the story is compelling today because Anne herself is so human. I think of, of her almost as a bird in a cage. She longs to be free. This production really represents, in some ways, a lot of work and effort on the part of the community and the students, and I'm just really proud of what they've done. I'm, I'm very proud of them. My name's Cassidy Woodbury, and I'm playing the part of Anne Frank, or as you're going to hear it in the play, Anna Frank. Anne Frank, as I've been told by my director multiple times, is most like, in this play, a puppy especially in the first act. She's really excited about everything and interested in everything and just like a total sponge person. She soaks up every experience that she comes into. No, it's nothing like that. Anne Frank is a typical teenager because she's, she's totally obsessed with the opposite sex. She's totally excited by realizing that she has a talent as she's coming into adulthood. The play has appeal to everybody because it could happen to anybody. Anybody could have been stuck in her situation. It's pretty funny for being something that everybody thinks is really downcast and stuff. There's a lot of surprising things about the Diary of Anne Frank, and if I told you what they were, they wouldn't be surprises. Uh, my name is John Thornberry, and I have multiple roles in Diary of Anne Frank. I'm, uh, I'm playing Otto, uh, Anne's father and I am also the scenic designer and the sound designer and I'll be assisting with lighting design. Otto is uh, uh, Anna Frank's father. Uh, he's very solid, he's very centered. Um, he's, he's looking out for the safety of everyone. Uh, he has a lot of compassion, a lot of heart about him. I do think the audience here is in for a really good show. Um, we have a, a terrific cast. Uh, it's a cast of ten. We have, we have terrific talent on the stage. Uh, people who have been on the stage here before, so uh, you'll see some familiar faces. And the, the script is really, really terrific. Although it's very touching, dramatically very moving, it's not complete gloom and doom from curtain to curtain. Uh, there's a lot of humor in this show, a lot of warmth. The more that people come here to enjoy this show, the better. But if they walk away from here thinking about how is this relevant to what we are part of today, then I think we've done our job.